In this video, I am going to convert a photo to a cross stitch pattern using Pattern Grid at Craft Design Online. This is the photo I am going to convert. It has a lot of detail and colour. First, I will choose some suitable settings. I am going to make a 100 by 50 pattern and I will turn off the grid lines to make it clearer. The cell shape is square for cross stitch without staggered rows. Since I am making a cross stitch pattern, I'll use a DMC colour range with the maximum number of colours. Now I'll add the photo to the pattern. Open the tracing menu and click New Tracing Image. Then click the Choose File button and select the photo. We can now see the photo mixed with the pattern. I'll need to move the photo so it's where I want it. I can drag it to position it correctly. I'm going to use the easiest method of converting a photo, Auto Trace. Auto Trace works particularly well on complex images, but it does take several seconds to complete. I'll move the transparency slider to show the pattern. That looks a bit mushy, I want more detail. I'll increase the grid size to 150 by 75. Then click the magic fill button. Yes, that looks a lot better. The clouds look slightly banded. I will use the dither control in tracing settings to fix that. I can select a bit more dither, maybe 30%. Then use the magic brush to repaint the clouds and the grass. That's looking great. The pattern is now ready to be turned into a chart or saved in my gallery. Let's have a look at the chart. Because the pattern is large, it's been broken up into six blocks. Thanks for watching. Find us at craftdesignonline.com/patterngrid.